Hello and welcome back to my playthrough of Dragon Age Origins. Um, let's get straight on to uh, where we left off, right? Uh, where where did we leave off actually? It's been a few hours. We've just come out. Oh no, we were about to go into the assembly, weren't we? Oh, did I? Yes, I did. Cool. Warden, welcome. It is always a blessing for Orzammar to host your order. I am Vartag Devorn, top advisor to our good Prince Balin. What news do you bring? Uh, you know who I am? It would be hard not to notice the Grey Warden and his eclectic entourage. I hear you seek the aid of Orzammar's finest. I need aid against a blight. Yes, the treaty. I've seen it in the Shaper's libraries. Now the difficulty is that the treaty only compels our king, and we are sadly lacking one of those right now. Uh, is there some way I could help? My prince is the rightful king, but a disappointing number of lords back the upstart Haramond for the throne. If you show your support for Prince Balin, he might be able to assist with your requests. Uh, what do I need to do? Haramond promised the same portion of his estate to two different deshers, Lady Dace and Lord Helmy. Oh, excuse me, two assembly members. Desher is their formal title. Haramond can't possibly grant it to both of them, but they won't find out until after the vote is cast. I have copies of the promissory notes Haramond gave each of them. Once they see those, they should both reconsider their votes. Uh, where did you get the promissory notes? That's not important. If they ask, say you found them while searching the Shaper's libraries for your treaty. Fair enough. I'll find Lady Dance, Dace and Lord Helmy right now. Lady Dace doesn't leave the quarter much. But Lord Helmy's adventurous, likes to spend his time at Tapsters in the Commons. Oh, okay. Remember, don't tell them you got these papers from me. You learned of them and drew your own conclusions. Okay. <laughs> oh, well. Hot's a bloody yawning. Right, let's go find them, shall we? Hello? I heard there was a Grey Warden here. I am Doolin Ferender, second to Lord Harrowmont, King Endrin's own choice as successor. Word is spreading that the surface may suffer a blight. It is shameful we are not in a better position to help. I have a treaty obliging Orzammar to aid against a blight. That may be, and that is a terrible risk for the surface. But even if the world would end tomorrow, Lord Harrowmont cannot ignore Balin today. He cannot afford to trust anyone of unproven loyalties. Stop playing games. This treaty compels you to help. You're asking the King of Orzammar to send armies to the surface, but Orzammar has no king and we have no army. Right now. The men who should be fighting Darkspawn are brawling in the street. If this situation is not resolved, we face civil war. If you want Lord Harrowmont's time now, you'll have to prove you have no intention of turning against him later. So you would make the world, whole world wait? If you wish to show you have no loyalty to Balin, then work against him in Harrowmont's name. Balin is hosting a proving today, supposedly to honor his father's memory. The Deshers take it very seriously, and unfortunately, Balin found some way to blackmail or intimidate House Harrowmont's best fighters into stepping down. You want me to find out why your fighters dropped out? That would be enlightening, though I hope you won't pry too deeply into things they don't wish revealed. If you wish to show your loyalty, enter the proving as his lordship's champion. 
With your order's reputation, I've no doubt the ancestors would favor your arm. Balin would never work with anyone who humiliated him in that way. Haramont would have no fear of meeting with you then. Uh... I will not let Haramount send me on this round runaround. Uh... I don't... This is the part of the game I have no clue about, because I'm not sure who to really go for. I think I've always gone Balin. I believe. I can't remember. Uh, I don't want to start picking sides. Then I'm afraid your only choice is to wait until there's a winner. Lord Harrowmont cannot risk his life working with someone of unproven loyalties. If you change your mind, let me know. The proving is this afternoon, and Lord Harrowmont could certainly use you on his side. Uh, no, we'll go Harrowmont. Not Harrowmont, uh, Balin again, I suppose. Right. Uh... That looks like this way. News of the hour. Two more clans endorse Lord Balin as the new king. Questions arise regarding oh. Lord Balin's impending marriage. Lady Dace. What do you want? Ah, oh, I suppose you're the Grey Warden everyone's talking about. I am. Uh, you might want to look at these papers. Well, this isn't exactly a surface broadsheet. Where did you get these? Never mind. It is true enough. But there's nothing I can do about it. This deal was made on behalf of our entire house. Only my father can revoke it. Where is he? I'll bring these to him. He is leading a deep roads expedition, trying to secure an ancient tig. It's oh, unlikely he'll good. be back before the election, but perhaps this vote is important enough for you to brave the tunnels to tell him? The Dace family would be in your debt. I'll go tell him. Thank you. He was searching an old Idukan site. He left me with this map, in case his expedition never returned. I'll give you a pass as well. Usually, no one is allowed past the front lines. Good luck. Oh, thank you. Right, let's go to the was it the tapestry? That the person said two years tomorrow. By all the holy sodding ancestors. How can you people just ignore that? Bronca didn't go alone, Ogren. She took the whole house. Everybody but you. So just get over to Tapsters and drown yourself already. You know as well as I do, that's how this always ends. You think I'm afraid of some cub warrior who's barely off the teach? Ha! <laughs> I'll... You lift a weapon or attack a single citizen in Orzammar, and you're stripped of your caste and exiled. Even you can't have forgotten that. Get out of here before I call a guardsman. Right. Let's go to the tapestry then. Uh, that was the other side, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, imports, armors, tappers, tavern. Not the tapestry. Alright, was it this one? Yes. Told him I don't understand why the provings aren't open to everyone. I mean, it's how the ancestors show their favor. Do they really need our help to decide who's worthy? And then he practically slapped me. Hm. Lord Denik Helmy, honored desher of the Orzammar Assembly, and terrible disappointment to my esteemed mother, who doesn't like me spending time in taverns. You understand what I'm saying, right? On the surface, there are no casts, and it works fine. Am I right, Warden?
Most humans treat my people like your castless. But there are those like you who see this with concern, no? Well, I've yeah. taken the time to actually talk to the other castes. You know, most smiths and tavern keeps would make decent dashes if we gave them a chance and a seat in the assembly. Or Zamar is so mired in tradition no one bothers asking if the castes are even necessary. How does the caste system work, anyway? Badly. Oh, you're serious? Well, it's simple, I guess. The king and elected deshers of the assembly are at the top. Then it's the nobles. Then the warriors and all the craftsmen. At the bottom are servants. The castless and criminals are below even that. Your caste is determined by that of your same-sex parent. And that's where you stay your whole life, whatever your skill. So they've got no choice of what they are, then. That sucks. I have news. Haramount is double-dealing you and Lady Dace. Oh, well, I'd ask for proof, or why you care, but frankly, I'm so tired of it I'm not even surprised anymore. I don't even want the land, but my house would kill me if I turned it down. Responsibilities, you know. Now I'll have to go through the whole process of rejecting the deal. And they'll both have to try something else. And I thought it was going to be a nice day. I vote for Haramount if you didn't want the land. I actually thought he was the better candidate. You must think I'm pretty sorry naive, huh? They're all the same, well-dressed, blood-sucking cave ticks. I'll have to inform Mother that Lord Harrowmont hasn't bought our vote after all. Right. We've done that part. Now we've got to go find Lord Anward Dace in the Deep Roads. And if I'm not mistaken, it's the other side to get to the deep roads. Wait, what's this way? Dust Town. Ah, General Goods Merchant. Oh, hello. Back to buy something, I hope. I want that surface wealth coming back to us. I'll take your gold. Oh, this guy. Loves of diligence. They are better than what I've currently got equipped. Uh, they're kind of better than what Liliana's got equipped as well. That's definitely better. And that's not. Well, she can't equip it actually. She doesn't have the 34 strength needed. Never mind. Let's um Let's go to the deep road, shall we? What's this? An elf? I'm sorry, but I cannot allow you past the front lines without Adesha's permission. And I've heard nothing of any new patrol scheduled to leave today. I'm looking for Lord Dace's patrol. I see you have his daughter's seal, so I will not stop you. But be careful. Just because the beasts have pulled back from Ozamar doesn't mean there are any fewer in the deep roads. Either we finally have the edge, which I doubt, or the beasts are building up numbers for the next attack. Hmm. Uh, actually, they've made their move on the surface. The surface? But I thought the vermin never went up that far, except it. Except during blights. Ancestors save us if that's what's happening. What do you know about Paragon Bronca? What anyone knows. She went out there with her entire house, and she's never coming back. You don't think maybe she's still there, Commander? She is a paragon, after all. And now she's an ancestor. No one lasts two years in the tunnels. 
Are the dark spawn the only danger in the tunnels? Of course not. Down here, you're bound to run into giant spiders, deep stalkers, and other vermin. Lovely. Deep stalkers? Ugly beasts they are. Walk on two legs, but they have the head of a worm and hunt in packs. Watch out. They're not afraid to take on a group their own size. I've never really noticed the head being a worm. Okay. Are there no dwarfs past this point? A few outposts. Legion of the Dead, mostly. Fools that they are. Some scavenger types, too. Legion of the Dead? It's an independent company of soldiers. They accept no command but their own. Anyone who can bear arms can join, no matter his crimes <laughs> or sanity. They hold a funeral when they join and swear their only goal is a glorious death. I should go. Best of luck. Oh, before we do, actually, let's go back to the Tapper's Tavern and talk to Ogryn, because he was there. Hmm. Where was he? He was back here, wasn't he? What do you want? Hey, I heard about you, Grey Warden, coming from the surface. Great crisis in the world. Someone saw you talking to Vartag Gavorn, and now it's all over that you've been doing dirty errands for Balin. I figured you'd be the one, you know? Who could help me find Branca? But I guess you're just like all the rest. All the rest of whom? Power hungry deep lords. The only real concern they have is whose ass gets the throne. You don't have to play dumb, Warden. Their lackeys only come to me when they want something. Well, if you want the secrets of a paragon, do the work and find her. Is that who Branca is? She's the Paragon? City's only living Paragon, and she's been lost in the Deep Roads for two years. Two years, and no one's raised a bleeding army to go look for her. Why do you care, huh? You looking to uncover all her secrets? Is that what Balin wants? I know he's been poking around, trying to find things out about her, what she was looking for. Won't tell me spit, though. He wants it for himself, right? A little blessing from the ancient's technology, and he's assured the throne. Is that it? Uh, what if I generally want to help you? Too little, too late. But it's a nice gesture, Warden. If you think your boot kissing will get you an in I don't have, you're welcome to try this. <laughs> I know both Harrimont and Balin have been asking about her. Two years without a peep, and suddenly now they want to start looking. If you find out what they know, it might just put me a step closer to finding her. Or sit here and have a drink. It's all the bleeding same to me. Barkeep! Sod off, Duster. Okay. Did we fail to recruit him, then? Because I know he's the missing companion that we need to get them all well there is also the secret companion but i don't think that's a permanent one Rune plates. 50 XP, nice. More info. Once home to Orzammar's most powerful clan, this Tig's loss was a great blow to the dwarves. Okay. Uh, hold on a sec.
sorry about that. Just messaging someone. Where were we? Uh... Ooh. That looks like it can open at some point. That doesn't look... It looks too bright. It looks destroyable, that's for sure. But... Hey. Say the word. And we... Do we have to be a warrior? I guess not. That's definitely a way we need to, we can go. Watch out. Stone, deep mushroom. Where are we going? We're just we're just going this way, right? So we can't go that way because it's blocked off. Yes. running around as Liliana, right? Because of, of maybe traps. And obviously chests that we can unlock. Oh. Ooh, where's this? No. We'll loop this room first before we go anywhere. That looks like a dead end, so let's go up there. Bag of limbs? Asunder? Wasn't that the book that we were on about the other day? Was it yesterday? It was when we looked up if Win was in any other games and it told, and I, it said something like she was mentioned or she was in the book called Asunder. I think that was what it was called. Right. That way's blocked. Can go that way. Or I could go that way. Um Let's go that way, I think. Mm -hmm. right, let's get over here so this gets as you say. Watch out! No. Oh, I start. There is no hope for you now! 
Ouchie. Just like you wanted. Anything else? So I'm guess No, that wasn't a dead end, right? It was it is that way, but if we go this way, it leads to somewhere. Hmm. <clears throat> Don't look now, but well, look now. Deep stalkers. They do have like a wormy type head. That's cool. Can't really get close to it, but it's like a mix of the you know little really tiny dinosaurs in um, Jurassic Park. It's kind of like a mix of them and just with the worm head. That's pretty cool. Right, which way are we going? We can go both ways. Oh, we must fight right okay. away. About to say my phone needs charging, so let me. Good for you, Win. Good for you. That leads back to... Oh, that leads to the dead end. The other side of it. Damn wheel. I need new wheels on this bloody chair. I really do. That's basically a dead end both ways then. Nothing there to it. Can go down, but we can go back the way we came and go down that one. That might lead us to there anyway, the crossroads. But I'm I'm gonna backtrack anyway, I think. I'm actually I might even just go straight ahead when we hit the crossroads. And turn right if it gives me the option. It does not give me the option. So I think I'm going to backtrack until we hit that area. Which is annoying because it takes so bloody long. To run anywhere in this game. Was it this yeah, one? Yeah. Stuck. Yeah, it was. On my way.
Yes. On ice. As you said. There we go. Yes. That's the mage one dealt with. It will be done. Very oh, well. Deep stalker. Only a singular one. Okay. We must fight as oh, you no, like. There's another. Oh, here they come. As you say. Of course. As you say. Very well. Now you die. Yeah, that's right. What did I tell you? <laughs> I'm stupid death stalker. Right, that's you cannot go to there, cool. We'll carry on this way anyway. See where this leads. What strange beasts? Where? I know on the mini map there's things over there. What are we fighting? Hold the bottom. Don't let them make off with another one. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that's careful. I don't think that's the last of them. Oh, yeah. oh no, definitely not. Oh, we found Lord you Dace. You pulled us from a tight spot, friend. You have my gratitude. I am Lord Anwar Dace. So how does an elf come to be down here anyway? Lord Paramount is trying to cheat your family. No, wait, you should look at these papers. I don't understand. What could... These are the terms of a deal we made with Lord Paramount, <laughs> but... The charlatan. He's promised the exact same land to hell me. Thank you for bringing this to my attention. I owe you twice now. My life and my house's fortune. You tell your daughter not to vote for Lord Harrowmount? We will certainly not support a man who would use my family like that. I will tell everyone I know what a wretched trick Harrowmount tried to play. I must return now. My men need healing and I want to look into this. You wish to travel with us? No, I'm going to explore further, I think. Be careful, then. There are more dangerous things than deep stalkers down here. Okie dokie. I want to loot. That's why I don't want to go right now. What's next? Uh, there was a chest here as well. Ooh, there's a bridge. I finished. There was something over here, wasn't there? Right back there. Oh, there's something over there as well. Yep, here it is. Let me up. Up oh, there's stairs, never mind. Fancy vase. Um. Yeah, please. 
Is indeed. I think it thinks we're supper. <laughs> <laughs> So loud. That's annoying. Oh, that leads to. Oh, okay. Well, I guess we we have got that way to go still because we backtracked, didn't we? So let's quickly go there. Right, uh, we need to turn right here at the crossroads. It does lead to somewhere, right? Leads to loot, but that's right. These beasts off. <laughs> That's a deep stalker leader then. Just like you wanted. What now? Right, I guess we've explored all we can in this place for now anyway I don't I believe that was a dead end that branch there I'll go back to it well we we need to go that way anyway but we'll go back to it and have a look again shall we Right head leads to a dead end. Yeah, that leads to a dead end. Cool. <clears throat> yep, it was up this way. was that one straight ahead of us right yeah that is a dead end currently but from the looks of the map it does look like it will open up at some point same with that branch up there so let's uh yes let's go this way and back to the Orzammar Markets area, I suppose it's called. Didn't really pay attention to what it was called exactly.
Towards Mar we go. That's a lot of deep roads that we've got to explore. Right, what do we have to do then? Uh, return to Vartag. You have spoken to both Lord Hel Helmi and Lady Dace and convinced them that Harrowmount is not to be trusted. It is time to return to Vartag in the Chamber of the Assembly to see if any progress has been made. Uh, she believes that one of her, one daughter of the house may have survived the Darkspawn and that she is a descendant of that daughter. What? Oh, right, yes, she wants to, us to prove that she's noble. Uh, Shaper reported a theft from the Shaper at the thief has a bold head and gar garish tattoos, suggesting he is a brand from the slums. Oh, does that mean we've got to go to Dust Town then? So that is the slums, right? We'll do that quickly. To see if anything pops up. Well, to see if anything is down here. Anyway. I ah, uh, I think I just stepped in something. Lovely. We might want. Enemies ahead! We'll get plenty for their kid once I cut them out of it. Ah! Oh, lovely. Ah! 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 Of course. Ah! As you say, it will be done. Oh, well. Double icing. Let's have at it! I never liked this part. Castless new codex. Hi, Roger. Who are you? You don't look like any guardsman I ever saw, and that's not much of a uniform. I'm Chocobos, a Grey Warden. Oh. You looking for a chance to bring in some coin? Could be I have that opportunity. Especially for someone with a few connections above ground. I'd have to hear what you're asking. Human kings, you know. They make these ridiculous laws. Like about who gets to buy in Silurium. The sacred gift the stone provides us to show her love. No law should regulate that. The laws are meant to keep mages away from the stuff, so there's always yeah. buyers in the Circle Tower. I got one man named Godwin. He's expecting a delivery of a stone's weight. You want an investment opportunity? Uh, I could see fit to, say, sell you that lyrium instead at the reasonable price of 50 sovereigns. You can Fifty. keep it or... Since you can travel freely from here, sell it to Godwin, who you know is buying. And uh, if you bring back his return order, I could pay you, uh, say, 20 sovereigns as a finder's fee. Must be dangerous if you're paying so much. More so for someone like you, I guess. Most dwarves born down here have a natural immunity. Other races, there are problems if they spend too long with the ore. The real issue is that lyrium's valuable. It's only found down here, and human mages can't work without it. I don't have that kind of money. Long as you keep your eyes down and your mouth shut, we've got no further business. I did have that kind of money, but I kind of... Got rid of it. <laughs> Beggar. Ooh, assembly directive. It's 
spare a bit for the needy? Please. Someone there. Slum's house. Let's see what we can spare her then. Have you a coin to spare, my lord? It's for my son. He's sick. He hasn't any clean clothes to wear or anything to eat today. Neither have I. Why doesn't your son's father help you? A question I ask every day. He was eager enough for a daughter who would bring him into the mining caste. But since the boy was born, I've not seen Noser heal of the lout. And me alone on the street, forbidden to return to my family unless I... But no, I can't bear to even think of it. What does your family want you to do? My son's father is castless, as is he. I used to be a miner, but my parents stripped my caste and refused to accept me back. Unless oh. I agree to abandon the child in the deep roads and pretend I never bore him. That's horrible. I cannot abandon my baby. The Shapers teach that only children of true lineage exist, not those born castless. But they never carry the child. He cries like any other infant and smiles when he's warm and full. I can't kill him because of an accident of birth. An accident I forced on him. No, I'm not going to pick that bottom one. Uh, maybe I could reason with your family. Y you would do that? But why? I don't like to see a child suffer. Then I cannot offer enough gratitude. But I warn you. My father is a stiff-necked man. His name is Ordell, and he's usually at Tapster's in the evening. I do not think okay. he will listen to you. But I will wait anxiously to see if you can do what you promise. I'll try my best. Not promising anything. Ooh, suspicious-looking door. This door appears to be made out of solid stone. There are no visible means of opening it. On closer inspection, there is a small slot concealed in the fold of the stone. Just big enough for a finger. Look through the slot. You see nothing but blackness. Okay. I finished. Um. What's next? Okay. Hmm. Ooh, that looked like a house. Alimar's Emporium. What are you looking for? We got nothing to buy for the likes of you. Or maybe you wanted to sell. Let me see your wares. Of course. Uh, let's sell everything that we can. I don't think anything's going to be that useful for us except for them gloves I still haven't equipped that uh, let's get rid of them and that um I don't need toxin extract anymore, do I? Wait, does he have any flasks? No. Never mind then. Alright, let's go back to the assembly hall. So I don't think we've got anything else to do here. Gotta do a lot of running just to get to it. Annoyingly.
Lord Balin suspected of personally defacing statues of a... Raise your voice in favor of Lord Balin. He will this one? No. Nope. It was this one here, wasn't it? Lady Dace just came through the quarter on a tear. She's telling everyone who'll listen what a leech and a liar Haramont is. Good job. So you were serious about wanting to help us. Are you yep. ready to meet Balin now? Uh, I'm ready. Take me to him. I warn you, be on your best behavior and keep your weapons sheathed. Okie dokie. I am impressed, Warden. Not many outsiders so quickly grasp Orzammar's rather convoluted politics. I am Prince Balin. Fartag told me of your efforts against the usurper who tried to claim my father's throne. Take it you're not too fond of Haramount. Haramount spent Haramount. his life in the assembly. He only knows how to lead through compromise and capitulation. That's not what Orzammar needs. The Darkspawn are massing for a blight. The land's topside have been torn apart. We need a strong leader now, someone who can stand up to the assembly. Someone who will rule, not persuade. What would you do differently as a king? There is only one thing of importance when I take the throne. The Blight. We need absolute unity to fight against the fulcrum of true evil. And you'll honor your agreement with the Wardens? Absolutely. And sworn on the mail of my ancestors, as soon as Orzammar is united under my rule. Unfortunately, while this debate rages, I have no power to send the troops you need. You've seen for yourself, the city is a slaughterhouse. Criminals run lawless. I could never hold the throne if I allowed such chaos. Uh, maybe I could do something about that. Jarvia and her carta are behind this bedlam. If you can eliminate them, I promise as king, I will send mm. as many troops as you need to fight the Darkspawn. Unfortunately, I have little information on Jarvia. Her base of power is in Dust Town, the lowest part of the city. Well, and my men have few sources there. Maybe the castless will talk more freely with a stranger. I'll go look for her right now. And I will wait eagerly for your return. Is there anything looting, lootable in here? Doesn't look like it. Damn. Oh, this is a big room. Whoa, wait. Masano gain. Oh, oh, wait. We can do that right now. That's one less side quest to do later on. More foes approach. Oh, hi. They were waiting for us. Oh, I am not my mate. <laughs> Damn it, stop interrupting me. There we go. Wait, he's a human person. What's he doing here? I suppose he's in the battle. Never mind. Yes. Another foe slain! Hm. What now? Ooh, I've got 50 XP, don't mind if I do. Did none of these actually drop anything lootable? That sucks. Right, how do we get out of here then? This way? No, this looks like a bedroom. Is 
Lady Brodens. I finished. Please be quiet. My patient needs a rest. Fools and their politics. <clears throat> the poison was probably imported as a king killer, and she got dosed by mistake. I've never seen anything this potent. Can I help? Warden, I don't know. Maybe you've seen something like this on the surface. Maybe you've used something like it. If you can chase these things down, I'll thank you. But I won't get my hopes up. The stone will take her soon. Exotic methods. Okay. Well, this wasn't the way we needed to go then. I suppose... Um, I'm going to call it here, have a five minute break, then I will be back. So, to whoever's watching, cheers, and till next one.